good morning friends so in the last uh, videos we covered what is concurrent collections what is the need of concurrent collections what are various concurrent collections we have and the first concurrent collection concurrent hash map we covered already right sir in the we discussed normal hash map concurrent hash map what is the difference when compared with uh, already let's say version of map objects hash map hash table synchronized map okay what is the difference between concurrent hash map when compared with existing thread set map objects all those things we covered now i have to talk about sir next concurrent collections okay what is that next concurrent collection is copy on write array list what is this concept sir copy on write array list okay this is the concept what i'm going to discuss sir copy on write array list the name itself indicates it is a related to array list correct it is related to array list it is the thread safe version of array list it is the concurrent version of array list right are you getting sir how we will get thread safety when compared with the normal array list what is the what is the advantage or what is the uh, what is the advantage how thread safety we are going to get in copy on write array list these things i will discuss sir the first point you people should aware copy on write array list is a thread safe version of array list object it is the concurrent collection which is the thread safe version of array list object type sir here just observe where is the place of this one with respect to api sir in the last session you people may have i hope collection interface is there for the interface is a list is there okay list is there for this list here implementation class is copy on write array list are you getting what is this one sir copy on write array list copy on write array list is the implementation class of list interface which is the child of collection right these two belongs to java.util package but this one belongs to java.util or concurrent package because it is a concurrent collection right okay this is sir very simple point number 1 copy on write array list is the thread safe version of uh, array list object it is the concurrent collection right now immediately you may ask why the word uh, copy on write array list are you getting just uh, have you observed right? copy on write uh, array list why the word next uh, how we are getting thread safety very simple sir here i have one array list object is there sir of course here cow a l copy on write array list is there sir copy on write array list one array list object is there why the word copy on write array list sir for every write operation sir here yeah, no, maybe a chance of multiple threads are allowed to operate are you getting there may be a chance of multiple threads are allowed to operate okay this t1 t2 and so on t and i if these threads perform a read operation there is no effect at all existing object only will be okay this is performed the read operation will be performed on the existing object if any thread want to perform write operation are you getting update operation that update operation will be performed on a separate cloned copy are you getting for every write operation for every write operation a separate cloned copy will be created clear for all of that okay this is on that cloned copy write operation will be performed so so update operation will be performed on separate cloned copy so the there is no effect for the threads which are performing read operation on that object right are you able to understand so obviously we will get the thread safety because every update operation will be performed on separate cloned copy clear for all of you sir if you want to perform read operation yes any number of read operations you can perform on the existing object if any thread performing update operation then for every update operation a new copy will be created a separate cloned copy will be created so on that copy update operation will be performed at the later point of time these two objects will be will be 
sink by the JVM. Are you able to get that? Okay. So these two versions uh, will be sink by the JVM at certain point. This thing is happening automatically internally, right? Is it clear for all of you? Sir, by this time, you have to remember only two points about copy and write a list, sir. Point number one. What is copy and write a list? It is a thread safe version of a list object. It is a concurrent collection. Then immediately the second time, sir. Why the word copy on? Are you getting why the word copy on? On how we are getting thread safety? Very simple. For every write operation, a separate cloned copy will be created. On that the cloned copy, update operation will be performed. So that we will get thread safety. Because the people, the threads who are performing read operation, no effect. Because if any person trying to modify with that modification, a new object will be created. Clear for all of you? Okay, this is. So later point of time, these two objects will sync, sync by the JVM automatically internally. This is the sir thread safety. Version of your list, which is nothing but one copy and write a list. Sir, how we are getting thread safety in the case of copy and write a list? Maybe a chance to ask a very simple sir. Sir, I have one error list object. Is there if any person trying to modify that modification done on the separate cloned copy? So then for the threads which are accessing existing error list object, there is no effect at all. So that we are getting thread safety. Clear for all of you? Why the word copy on write error list? Okay, like. Sir, now immediately mask. Sir, for every update operation, a separate clone copy, a separate clone copy is going to create. Suppose I am performing thousand update operations, sir. I am performing thousand update operation. Then how many copies are required to create, sir? Thousand copy, which is a big performance overhead, sir. Are you getting? So that's why. So if more number of read operations are there. Less number of write operations are there. Then copy and write a list is recommended to use. So if more number of write operations are there, copy and write a list is the worst choice because there may be a chance of performance overhead. So clear for all of you? So what is copy and write a list? How we are getting thread safety? Why the word copy and write a list? When copy and write a list is the best choice, sir. If more number of write operations are there, copy and write a list never recommended because for every write operation, a separate clone copy will be created. Right? Clear for all of you? Right? Okay. This is how we are getting thread safety. Clear, right? Okay. That's it.